to test the presence of starch, proteins and fats in food. Our food contains different essential nutrients. Some of these nutrients are fats, proteins and starch. The presence of these nutrients in the food can be detected using certain tests. Madam, how will you detect the presence of nutrients like starch, proteins and fats in food? We will perform biurate test and xanthoproteic test to detect the presence of nutrients in food. Biurate test by adding blue vitriol solution and caustic soda solution to protein, its color turns violet. Protein plus blue vitriol solution plus caustic soda solution turns violet in color. Xanthoproteic test. By adding concentrated nitric acid and ammonium hydroxide to protein, it gives an orange precipitate. Protein plus concentrated nitric acid plus ammonium hydroxide gives an orange precipitate. Let's do an experiment to test the presence of nutrients in food. The materials required are a potato, an egg, peanuts, five to six test tubes, a white paper, a Bunsen burner, a Petri dish, a test tube holder, a dropper, iodine solution, concentrated nitric acid solution, and ammonium hydroxide solution. Test for the presence of starch. Procedure Take a potato and cut it into four to five small pieces. Grind the pieces well. Take two test tubes, A and B. Add some water in both the test tubes. Put the pieces of potato in test tube A and shake it well. Now, add a few drops of iodine solution in both the test tubes. Observe any change in color. Observation The color of contents in test tube A changes to blue-black. This shows the presence of starch. Test tube B, which does not have any food item in it, shows no change in color. Result The blue-black color indicates the presence of starch in food, potato. Test for the presence of proteins. Procedure Take a test tube and put a small portion of egg white in it. Now, add a few drops of concentrated nitric acid in the test tube. Heat the test tube on a Bunsen burner. Remove the test tube from the flame and drain the solid content of the test tube into a Petri dish. Now put a few drops of ammonium hydroxide solution on it. Observe any color changes. Observation The color of the egg white changes to yellow on addition of nitric acid and to orange on adding ammonium hydroxide to it. Result This change in color from white to yellow and then to orange shows the presence of proteins in the egg white. Test for the presence of fats.
Procedure Take a white paper. Take a few peanuts and press them between the folds of the white paper. Now let the white paper dry for a while. Observation The white paper becomes translucent and an oily patch is seen on it. Result The oily patch on the paper shows that peanuts contain fats. Do's Wear an apron and hand gloves before starting with the experiment. Be careful while cutting potatoes. Don'ts Don't use broken test tubes. Be careful not to spill the chemicals around. Thank you, madam. This experiment has made the concept very easy to understand.